Hello everyone, welcome to the SOLIDWORKS webinar, Five Advantages of Managing Your Product Data on a Cloud Platform. My name is Mariana St. Germain and I'm on the product management team here at SOLIDWORKS, responsible for our go-to-market strategy. Joining me today is my colleague, Mohit Daga, also on the product management team. Mohit is the product owner for our data, project and lifecycle management tools on the 3D Experience cloud-based platform. Today, we'll review five advantages of managing your product data on a cloud platform and show you a few examples of the 3D Experience platform and the 3D Experience tools for data project and lifecycle management. We'll also highlight Square Robot's success in using some of these tools to deliver innovative solutions for submerged inspection of oil and gas tanks. We'll wrap up with a list of takeaways and then followed by a question and answer session with Mohit. According to a recent survey, companies of all sizes are increasing their investment in the clouds, so much so that a whopping 94% of respondents use cloud technology. Why is that? With the need to support faster product development cycles, many organizations are relying on cloud technology to enable better connected teams and more agile processes. One of the key challenges they face is making product and lifecycle data instantly accessible and shareable across multiple disciplines, remote locations, and different devices. While data and lifecycle management tools in the cloud can help you solve some of these challenges, a cloud-based platform enables you to transform really the way you work. By integrating all pieces of the product development process, from CAD design to simulation and manufacturing, as opposed to using disjointed tools, you can develop new products faster and make fewer errors. Because all pieces of your processes are connected, teams can easily collaborate in real time using all the available data. And now let's see the advantages of cloud platforms for managing your product data and lifecycle. Since we'll give you examples based on the 3D Experience platform, I'd like to spend a moment to describe it. The 3D Experience platform is a cloud-based ecosystem of interconnected apps. Rooted in 3D design, it goes far beyond that. It helps you improve everyday workflows with capabilities such as design, advanced simulation, data, project and lifecycle management, and more. So the first advantage of cloud platforms is reducing your total cost of ownership. Because the platform is in the cloud, you don't need to install or maintain software, hardware, or any infrastructure for that matter for your application. This means you can minimize IT overhead and lower both your upfront and ongoing costs. This lowers your barriers to entry and lets you access the technology you need when you need it. For example, the 3D Experience platform enables you to start with the platform, which gives you basic capabilities such as creating your own dashboards and social communities for discussion. And you can expand your tools from there exactly as your business needs dictate. You can add solutions, for example, such as advanced simulation, data, project and lifecycle management, manufacturing, and more based on your business needs. The second advantage is the ability to always use the latest technology. This matters particularly if you're in a competitive industry that moves fast. A cloud-based platform gives you instant access to new technology and more frequent releases. This means your teams can improve the way they work and turn it into a competitive advantage. They can get more done, produce higher quality products, and create more compelling customer experiences. For example, the 3D Experience platform gets updated multiple uh, times a year, every few months. This means that new tools become available and existing tools get better all the time. Your third advantage is the ability to connect to your people. This means your teams can collaborate in real time regardless of boundaries such as 
disciplines, locations, or even devices. It's important to have the flexibility to set the right access level for various team members so that the right people get access to the right information at the right time. Collaboration tools let you share and review product data. For example, the 3D Experience platform enables you to create custom dashboards and share information uh, with them, but also communities so you can discuss designs and collect feedback. So Mohit, can you show us these capabilities? Sure. Um, so one of the things that Mariana mentioned is uh, how we can collaborate in real time via dashboards and communities. So when you log into the platform, you'll be presented with a dashboard. This is a dashboard where there are multiple different tabs, multiple different apps all in one place. You can see your MySolidWorks website here, access your data via 3D Drive, and also look at this design communities, which are kind of like social platforms. Here, one of my colleagues has posted a question in the design community, asked for answers based on uh, the different members of the dashboard, and you can quickly review those in the community that they have. You can see you can easily scroll up and down uh, in the community. In the, this uh, snippet, you'll see how in a community you can quickly collaborate with a concept sketch. So here, someone in the community is posting a concept sketch from their local uh, desktop. They upload it, put in a comment, and ask, uh, ask for other members of the community to kind of collaborate. From here, once as soon as it goes up in the community, is ready, uh, readily accessible with the other members. Now, if another member wants to put in a comment in based on the concept sketch, they can just go in and say, it's fantastic, I'll go ahead and create the PCB, I'll add the design, and you move on with it. So here you quickly saw how dashboards and communities are really native to uh, connecting your people across the platform. Thank you, Mohit. Moving on to the fourth advantage, the ability to connect your data. The goal here is to enable team members to easily access the most up-to-date and accurate information. Cloud-based platforms give you the ability to store CAD and other data in one secure place so everyone can access it from anywhere at any time and any device from a web browser. Bringing together your models, simulation results, manufacturing plans, as well as business data such as sales figures or, say, marketing campaigns, gives you a well-rounded view of your products and business. For example, the 3D Experience platform makes your CAD data available to tools on the platform without the need for conversion. Therefore, there is no duplication, rework, or errors. Mohit, uh, could you give us an example of working with the connected data? Sure, absolutely. Let me show you what we can do. So um, in this example, you'll see you're within SOLIDWORKS. We have this access to this app called Collaborative Task, where you can open your design directly from a task from within SOLIDWORKS. This is just an add-in from within SOLIDWORKS. You, all you do is have to hit open. It opens the model within your SOLIDWORKS. You never have to leave the CAD tool. Now here, for example, if you want to make changes or edits, you can do that now. And with a click of a button, it can go up back to the platform. So let's have a look at that. So here, I made my changes that I wanted to after pulling the design down. Now I want to save it back. The system is smart enough to recognize that only a couple things changed. Not everything changed. So it'll only push those things that were changed back up to the platform. So very simply, as soon as you upload it back to the platform, everyone who has access to the design who is on your platform will see the updates. Now, if I come back to the platform and switch uh, examples a little bit just to show that it works for the multiple use cases. Now, if I come back to the concept sketch that we were showing earlier. Now, if it was uploaded to the platform, you can have a look at um, in this app called 3D Play where you can quickly uh, do sectioning, annotations. You can do a lot of things directly from the platform. You don't even need access to a CAD tool anymore. You just dragged and dropped it from a different app into this uh, visualization app, and I can do an annotation. I can do the what the distance is, I can uh, do a multiple different things, and I can also publish it back into the community that I was working on together with my designers. So here, you saw I took a quick, uh, quick screenshot. I put in, that's the layout, final version of the PCB shape and overall component layout. I push it back up to my community. As soon as I hit publish, you'll quickly see how I'm gonna switch tabs here, 
and go to the community where this was already uploaded directly. So here, th I just did that and uh, it shows up in the community right away. Thanks, Mohit. So now people are ready to jump in and make the next comment or the next iteration on the design. So uh, the fifth and last advantage we we're going to look at today is the ability to connect your ecosystem. A cloud-based platform can enable you to use the same data across disciplines, from design to simulation, data and project management, manufacturing, and more. Applications on the platform that work together and understand each other's data enable seamless workflows. And when your tools have a consistent user experience, it is easier to learn how to use the next one. In addition, you don't need to source and manage any uh, new vendors. For example, the 3D Experience platform enables you to manage your projects and also product lifecycle. Now let's turn again back to Mohit and see if we can, uh, if he can show us uh, these capabilities. Sure. Thank you, Mariana. Uh, we are going to look at again both the examples that I was showing earlier, where the first one is to show the benefits of project management and what we can do on the platform. Here we are uh, showcasing Chris, our engineering manager, who is uh, just assigned a task by the project planner uh, on their uh, team. As soon as something was assigned to him, he got a notification. Now he's on the move, but he saw the notification come in. All he has to do is refresh his page and he sees the task assigned to him. Now looking at the task, again, it was a generic task created saying, you have to complete it in a day. It's a thing to do for you. So he sets it into perspective by putting in 15 days of estimated time to complete the task, assigns it to the SolidWorks designer, and saves it. Another thing he does is actually adds the model, adds the attachment of the SOLIDWORKS model directly to the task. And as soon as he hits save, you'll see that the project plan extended because there was a limitation of this project is connected to the final deliverable, which is the design review. So that updated automatically. It's updated for everyone in the ecosystem. So you're connecting your ecosystem all together with this design change. Another example now, looking at going back to the PCB design that we did. Now, now we're back in SOLIDWORKS. Now here, I want to show you the lifecycle management capabilities. If you finished your design, you can very easily directly from CAD, say your design was earlier in work, you finished it, you've reviewed it, and now it's released. You saw that was the only part that needed to be updated. It was the only part in work. Now, once it's released, it sends a notification, depending on your workflow, it can send a notification to different members of your team saying the product is released, meaning it's ready to use. Back to you, Mariana. Yeah, thank you, Mohit. And now, um, let's take a look how these advantages work in practice. Well, we'll hear from a customer who uses the 3D Experience platform and its data project and lifecycle management tools to deliver a really disruptive product. Meet Square Robot, a startup creating robots that inspect submerged oil and gas tanks. I uh, am lucky to work remote for Square Robot. I live in New York and I'm here at headquarters in Boston about once a month. The PLM services has allowed us to share CAD data back and forth so that Sarah's models, both subassembly parts, can quickly integrate into that top level assembly. Square Robot doesn't have any servers. We basically use everything uh, cloud-based. Previously, we'd, we'd have to communicate on a regular basis and, and let each other know I'm working on this specific part at this specific time. With the new 3D Experience platform, it's a lot easier to see who's got what parts reserved and who's working on what, and you can see when it was last updated. It's drastically faster to get simple changes uh, shared. Sarah can upload an update, and I can hit refresh and pull down the new model instantaneously. So if I, if I wanted to make a change to this assembly, I can, I can open up each individual part and it, it'll pull up a whole new version of my session. And then once this is pulled up, I can go into my session and I can check to make sure that there haven't been any other changes um, because the platform will show me right here if, if Charles changed something and if I need to update my part. So if I decided to go in and I wanted to change the size of this hole, I could go in and, and easily change it to a different size. She just notified me that she's made the changes. I can open it up. At this point, you can see that the status, uh, I have an outdated model. There's a more recent version, so I can get revision. Uh, and then here, you can see that the whole size did increase from the previous version. The PLM Services has made that connection for multiple users to share CAD data. However, that isn't the only 
capability of the platform. It has a lot of other features that we're only scraping the surface at this point. If you're not designing your systems and not setting up your business such that you can get the best people wherever they are, you're going to have problems. And tools like a cloud-based PLM services solution help you get there, and you want to get those problems out of the way, because that's a problem you can solve, so solve it. Yes, thank you to Square Robot for sharing their story with us. And yes, let's make sure we solve all these problems that we can solve. Before we continue with the Q&A, let's summarize the five advantages of managing your data on a cloud platform. So we started with number one, reduce your total cost of ownership, which lets you minimize IT overhead. Number two, always use the latest technology to improve productivity and gain a competitive advantage. Three is connect your people for real-time collaboration across disciplines, locations, and devices. Number four is connect your data so everyone can access the most up-to-date and accurate information. And number five is connect your ecosystem for the ability to use the same data across disciplines and for seamless workflows. And now we'll address a few common questions we often hear from our customers. Our first question for Mohit is, what if we were not comfortable with a cloud-based solution? What are my options, Mohit? So that's a great question. That's one that, uh, that we hear a lot from uh, all of our customers, potential customers, prospects uh, all around. So uh, more and more companies are confidently moving towards the cloud nowadays. I'm sure we all witness that everywhere. However, if you're not comfortable at this time, you have several options. We have our industry-leading SOLIDWORKS PDM and SOLIDWORKS managed solutions, which are on-premise. They're ready for you to use. They're a great fit for customers who prefer an on-premise solution. Thank you, Mohit. It's good to know that customers have options. So where does SOLIDWORKS PDM and Manage fit into this puzzle? So again, again, a very common question, very nice follow-up to the previous question as well. So SOLIDWORKS PDM and SOLIDWORKS Manage are, like I said, are on-premise solutions our on-premise data management solution. Whereas what we're offering with the 3D Experience data project and lifecycle management tools are completely cloud-based cloud -based solutions. We want to offer our customers the flexibility to choose between on-premise and cloud solutions based on their business needs and requirements. We understand that not one size fits all and we want to give our customers the options. Hmm. So um, what about having the choice to work in a multi-CAD environment? Do the cloud-based solutions support that? Absolutely. I can talk for our, uh, our cloud-based solution, which is the 3D experience uh, solution. These solutions are architectured to work in a multi-CAD environment. We are going to start by supporting our in-house CAD brands, which is SOLIDWORKS and Katia, and then expand from there to support a truly multi-CAD environment. Sounds great. How about SOLIDWORKS data management products? Will they be replaced by 3D Experience products? Uh, I would say no. SOLIDWORKS will continue to offer the existing portfolio of data management products. What we want to offer our customers, like I said earlier, is the flexibility to choose between on-premise or on-cloud uh, services. 3D Experience platform will be completely on the cloud. We already have our on-premise solutions, which are industry leading in their uh, respective data management solution portfolios and we are not going to move, mm. uh, prefer one over the other, but we just want to offer the options to our customers. Great, so this is not a replacement, it's an addition. You have more choices. So our last question is, what happens to my data if I stop paying for the 3D experience data, project, and lifecycle management solutions? Uh, great question. This is uh, one that is asked frequently as well. Yeah, the answer to that is very obvious, like your data is truly yours. If you move your data to the 3D experience platform, you can access it from anywhere, at any time, from any device, with an internet connection. However, if you decide to stop using these solutions, you have the ability to download all this data and keep it for yourself. Great, thank you, Mohit. If you have any additional questions, feel free to contact Mohit at mohit.daga, D-A-G-A, at 3ds.com, as you see it on your screen. And with that, We'll wrap up our webinar. Thank you for joining us today and for being SOLIDWORKS customers. We we'll hope this was an informative session and we look forward to serving you. You can learn more about the 3D Experience platform and its solutions at www.solidworks.com. Enjoy the rest of your day.